I was part of this organization called Grammy University. Um, I just happened to, um, they, they put out these um, uh, kind of event invites, or at least at the time they did. And uh, I was like constantly searching for, well, what's the next event I can go to? I just wanted to meet as many people as I could. And one of the opportunities that came up was uh, seeing Armin Van Buren on Halloween weekend. This was 2015, I believe, 2015 at Pier 94 in New York City. Cool. And I had coincidentally already tickets to see Skrillex the next night on Halloween <laughs> night. So <laughs> I was like, okay, I'm, I'm going there no matter what. And I just happened to like, happened to be one of those first few people who got in through the door to get the spot. And Armin basically was giving this whole um, presentation about the new technology that he was using in his shows um, to this kind of a tight knit group of people that were invited through the organization. Nice. We're basically backstage at that venue. That's awesome. And he's just having, yeah, he's just like casually talking. And <laughs> there's some, uh, <laughs> he was, it's very funny how he was talking about like, I really want to make all kinds of music, but everyone just wants to hear me do trance music. And, <laughs> 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 and and uh, he has this proprietary technology that where he's able to communicate to the visuals and lights people, like what he's about to play next. Oh, neat. Um, so um, that's what he was doing, at least at that time. And um, and he was kind of showcasing how that worked. Um, and then we kind of hung out until the show started, and then we get to go to the crowd and see how it, everything worked, you know, in action. Um, but... Uh, Going from there, coincidentally, the touring manager of Armin uh, named Emily Tan was someone who en ended up uh, kind of showing up later on, you know, in multiple different areas. Um, she ended up becoming the touring manager for Andrew Rael, who nice. I'm still working with regularly. And um, uh, basically, uh, she then helped, you know, make all these other connections or other people involved who I also met along the way who were like friends with her. It's just a lot of like, you meet this person and then you meet another person doing this other project and then they come together and that connection helps build into something even better for the next project. 